An Estero community says sewage water is stinking up their area. This pond in the Cascade community is part of a wastewater treatment plant. The treatment plant belongs to Cypress Bend RV Resort. It's on Orange Tree Lane, just off US 41, south of Estero Parkway. NBC2's Hope Salmon spoke with people who have to deal with the stench every day. Here at the Cascades community, they have a pond like most communities do, but hopefully yours doesn't look like this. Take a look at all of that green on top. Residents got the water tested and they think the pollution is coming from the water waste plant that's just behind the trees and the wall over there. This is where it looks all the time. Looks like a mush of guacamole, smells like a sewer. Residents of the Cascades community in Estero noticed a sewage smell. They tried to figure out where it was coming from. Just behind this wall in the community is a wastewater treatment facility owned and operated by Cypress Bend RV Resort. Uh, this trailer park, like many of them throughout the state, um, operates with what they call a package wastewater treatment plant. Village manager Stephen Sarkozy says the plan has been around since the 60s. To his knowledge, it's working fine, but it's that it's seeping into our pond that's the problem. The HOA at the Cascades community had advanced aquatics test the water in November. The testing showed fecal bacteria was very high. The testing company then treated it, but the water got stinky again. So Mayor reached out to an FGCU professor. Applied aquatics analysis showed that there were very high levels of uh, nutrients and algae in the ponds, much higher than you normally see in stormwater ponds. And we have plans on not only uh, connecting this entire community to the municipal system that where we can eliminate the pond altogether. The project will be about 2.5 to 3.5 million dollars. It just created a lot more awareness in our community about the role of retention ponds. The village plans to have all RV parks that have a sewage set up like this hooked up to the village within the next 18 months. Reporting in Estero, Hope Salmon, NBC2.